My name is Bob Heikoop, I'm Chief Officer at the Jumbo Company and in my opinion it's absolutely the best job you can do on board a heavy lift vessel. You are in charge of the deck department, loading, discharging the cargo, securing the cargo and trying to get everybody involved, the crew, the cranes, the external parties, stewards, people from shore side, all on the same page. And to do that in the most efficient and the safest way, that's a challenge every single day. Things don't have to be changed because it has to be changed. It's all about can things be done more efficient, can things be done more safe. And that is why we are looking every single day on board the vessel, on the quayside and also in the office, can we do it more safe and more efficient. Staying sharp and trying to get the best out of it. I remember when I came for the first time on board a jumbo vessel, it was quite impressive, the cranes, the vessel itself but I also saw the, the, the rusty appearance of the vessel. And soon I start figuring out where does this rusty appearance come from. And the rusty appearance, it was also recognized by the commercial department of Jumbo that it can have a negative impact on the reputation of Jumbo. And I start searching for the source and soon I figured out it was coming from the installation and removal of the temporary welded securings, the securings which are used for securing the cargo on the deck on board the Jumbo vessels. And during the removal, especially during the removal of these temporary welded securings, the steel particles are spread uncontrolled over the deck by the use of an angle grinder and by gouging and by cutting. It ends up in the corners everywhere and in combination with seawater, it gives the vessel a rusty appearance. And the thing was that I have to find a solution for it. How can we get rid of all those uncontrolled spread steel particles. The solution for this problem actually could be found in two different directions. First of all having another securing, a way of securing the cargo or finding another way of removing this securing. And I choose for the option to find another way of removing this securing just because of the fact that welding and welded securing it's a proven way of securing the cargo and also flexible. We can put it everywhere on deck and Jumbo has proven it as a way of securing the cargo for years. Taking away and removing the securing by other means is possible by using a sand welding machine, a Jim 75. But the problem or the problem in the, in the current situation of this Jim 75 is that the steel particles which are spread uncontrolled over the area are still there. So I design based on another design of a cap which we normally use around an angle grinder. I use that ID and that design for this specific machine, this Jim 75, to catch all the release particles, the paint particles and the steel particles and contain them. Just to make sure that there will be no uncontrolled spread anymore. During the verification phase, we figured out it's not only about the controlled spread of steel particle, but it's also faster compared to the way how we re remove the securings now at the moment. And it's also better for the user itself, for the crew on board the vessel, because we have less vibration if you compare it to the angle grinder. So it's absolutely a machine which, besides the controlled spread of particles, also helps the crew to do the job more easy and more sustainable. This shows exactly that Jumbo is always looking for new ways of working, to find better solutions for the crew, to find better solutions for the vessel, for everybody involved. And that makes Jumbo strong, that makes Jumbo a reliable partner.